Hey, what's up? This is Kendra. I know we all are always trying to find the best mascara, so from now until June 1st, I'm going to do a mascara review every single day. And then on June 1st, I will be showing you guys my five favorite mascaras that I absolutely love. And I'm actually going to be showing them on a local morning show called AM Northwest. And if you are not a local to Portland, you can still check that out on citizensofbeauty.com. So my first review is going to be e.l.f. and it's their duo mascara. It's waterproof and regular mascara. Um, I was really impressed with this product. I wore it all day today. I have it on right now. I'll kind of get up close so you can see. This is a lengthening, thickening, and curling mascara. Uh, I really felt like it did thicken and lengthen. Curling, that's a little bit iffy. I don't really feel like it did that that much. But here's what the wand looks like. This is a spiral wand, so what it does is it really grasps the um, eyelashes when you pull it up. Gives you, it's supposed to give you a nice curl, but again, I kind of don't think it did that. Um, first coat of this was awesome. I saw a huge difference. I really don't have that much in the way of lashes, so to see a good length was pretty awesome. Second coat was a little bit more questionable. Um, my lashes felt a little bit hard. They were, um, it was a little bit harder to apply that second coat. It was kind of like a crisp factory going on. So um, I definitely didn't feel like I should apply a third coat. I felt like maybe that would be pushing it. But I am pretty happy with it um, as far as the two applications go. Now, um, I did have to do a touch up during the day. And when I did do the touch up, my lashes clumped together a little bit. So I had to re separate them. Um, and I've never had that problem with mascara before exactly, but I am being a little bit more picky since I am doing reviews, so maybe I just didn't notice it, I don't know. But I did find that to be frustrating. Like, you know when you cry and um, your lashes clump together? That's kind of what it looked like. So I wasn't too stoked about that. But um, as far as flaking or anything like that, there was no flaking. flaking. I didn't have any speckles on the face. Um, I really felt like it stayed all day long. I didn't have to do, uh, other than the picking, I didn't have to do any touch-ups. And did I mention already that this product is only $1? I don't think I did. So this product is $1. I have, so based off of that, really I don't have any complaints. It's not like I lost out on any money. It was $1 and I have to say I will be going back and purchasing e.l.f. mascara for one buck. Um, I really feel like you know, as far as any other drugstore mascara that I've used and having that wow factor, this definitely gave me more of a wow factor than any of the 9 or $10 over-the-counter mascaras. So I think you should check it out. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and check back with me tomorrow so I can tell you about another mascara review. Have a wonderful day. Bye.